we're back again at Fernie Alpine Resort, but this time we can see everything from top to bottom. It's gonna be a beautiful bluebird day, and I'm really excited to show the boys Fernie, and I've got a feeling the Polar Peak's gonna be open. So it's a good thing we came back. We're gonna ski some steep stuff, some slushy stuff, and maybe even find some pow. So uh, let's go take a poo, gentlemen. Ready to rip it? Morning glory to start the day. Wow, this is perfect. I can't ski on this. That's crazy. So my ski's got a huge core shot. I've never had a problem with this, but it's grabbing. Wow. So here is the base. You can see we got about literally maybe eight inches of core metal open on the edge and that's just grabbing like crazy on the inside edge. Anyways, we're gonna get another ski. Rob, what were your thoughts on uh, on your, your first ever run at Fernie? Well, you know, we got to leave it up to the team. The team was playing hard. They had uh, great turns. Pucks got deep and uh, you know what? At the end of the game, it's just a team game. I, I think Rob said is still at the Revelstoke Grizzlies <laughs> hockey game. Um, James, any thoughts about your first lap at Fernie? Uh, no, I've got nothing going on in, inside my head. Okay, Rob, uh, you want to put any words into James's mouth for him that we can dub in? Uh, not words I want to put in that mouth. Okay, we're going to end this interview now. Um, Fernie is a family resort. It's the least flattering ski maneuver. Soft in here, and more things and stuff. How does snow survive so long here? Huh. We say we love, we say we love. We gave it all, we gave it Big Dipper to Little Dipper, where are ya? Rob decided he needed to ski to the bottom, so it's just James and I. We gotta start the day with a boot pack. So stoked, so psyched seeing this in the blue sky. This is all right, eh, James? Not bad. Dude, this is just gorgeous today. Like, the views are blowing me away. Everything's looking epic. All right, let's go for a ski, Jimbo. You're all good to charge anywhere through here, James. Oh, it's crisp. Ha. Ha. He's crispy. She's a crispy girl. Go find Rob. <laughs> oh, there you are. You been here a while? Look at that. Polar Peak's gonna open today, baby. Hey oh. I'm on these little skinny skis. I don't want to just jump on it and fall off the nose. I wonder if I wrap this corner, it'll feel better. This should have been a straight line. I'm kind of just stuck. Oh, <laughs> Got caught in the tree. <laughs> ha! That's, that's more of a straight line kind of run. Yeah, that was not <laughs> That did not go 
as I wanted to. Straight line into the bowl. The snow's feeling good. <laughs> I don't even know the last time it stormed, but there's still some snow. This is the best slushy pal ever! Woo! Wow, it's hot! You! Ooh! Oh, that's heavy. Pulling me right out of my ski boots. <laughs> Bad news, I'm on a T-bar and the hot sauce has fallen out of my pocket. Orange helmet, this is screaming chicken. Uh, I got a bit of an emergency back here. Uh, it looks as though um, I'm on a T-bar and there's no hot sauce in my pocket. Please tell me how to proceed. I am stressing out. Rise now, fine, rise now, fine, rise now, fine. This is Adventure Rock and James. Please do not panic. I repeat, do not panic. We will get spicy. We will get spicy. Over. Thank you for the reassurance, Adventure Rob, and tell Jim to this morning. Bye. getting soft and grabby and fun. This mountain's a blast. We just we just did the entire traverse across the whole mountain. It is a wide mountain. There are aspects facing in pretty much all directions. So there's a funny mix of we've had kind of like light pow snow on the north aspects in the trees. We had like spring pow over there on Snake Ridge. We've had icy groomers. We're getting a mixed bag today and that's awesome. And this sun is just cooking down. Looks like Polar Peak is finally open. The boys are moving in. <laughs> hey Rob, there's no easy way down, pal. This last time I came, all I wanted to do was ski Polar Peak, and here we are about to ski Polar Peak. This is cool. And uh, this, is like a, this is like an avalanche uh, enthusiast kind of uh, show here, looking at all the crowns and it looks like patrol does some interesting work on there. We see like boot pack marks, ski marks, a lot of things going on. Yeah. Open right the peak to pint? Oh, this is, this is cool, man. Gorgeous. I kind of just want to go straight, 
straight through the heart of this thing. But if in a section with them killers, drug dealers, thug Never got to help from pops, they need some love Lick a mess and not the pain, so pull up no, Not too far from it, everything got it, seen and done it Late night running, hitting houses and police cuffing We ain't have nothing, house was cold, we were open oven Now we eating good, just hold ice, let's put buns in oven Bakeries linked up with quitting Of course, of course, Rob Rob goes right into the exposure. Oh, he's dodging Avi debris. Well, that rock. That was amazing. Dude. Of course. That was a pretty steep entrance, I gotta say. Was it? Yeah. I kind of want to try the furthest right one next time. Dude, 100%. That is so much snow. Let's party lap the Avi debris. Woo! Started making cheese, sushi overseas. The server, she's speaking Japanese. Flights to Paris, I'm at the loop to see Mona Lisa. Got a Desenada with rib seats and all your leaks. Tickets you like messy, little Nick. You shouldn't test me. Right so good. Just started working on my lefty. I'll be climbing up the charts if these just let me. Getting everything that's mine, I'm charging for lefties. Relaxing, man, I stay in action. Natural believer got me feeling like Imagine Dragons. 2017, I quit my job because it had to happen. Make my daughter proud. Look at me, and this your daddy rapping. So you see those two little shoots there. Rob skied the one in the middle. And now I'm gonna go ski the one on the far right. They look steep, fun, and Rob said, kind of scary. They're kind of scary. What a first turn. Start the cameras rolling in five seconds and then we'll go, sound good? Three, two, one. And drop, Jimbo. Sweet. Guess we'll meet Rob down here. Ooh. Let me hear that back. I just said that ain't nobody else in the studio but me. I record myself. Side <laughs> and show. I made the beat. Bob, more like sideshow Rob. <laughs> Hopefully a few of those shots look good. I skied that middle line. I definitely think that's probably the most puckering and the most fun on this chair um, that I can see. Uh, but James and I skied together should look pretty cool. And hopefully that Avi debris shot of the boys kind of whipping through look cool. I've never been in a hotter bowl on a ski hill in my entire life. I've been modified, 45, feeling like a Mordecai. I ain't wrecking learn, feel like you're aware of 45. Traumatized, victimized, my seen some of the now. Knock you off a base with a bat when them niggas slide. Homicide, genocide, 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 perpetuating war. That'll not go, eh? That will not go. And that you're the heat, you're the side. Hood, tackle, hood, life, my niggas doing dope, guys. I'm running to the cops, that's a big exercise. Uh, the running to the cops, that's the motto. I don't see it coming to an end like Legato. Get chipped like Sakato, send a wave through the hood, now it's sounding like Verado. Sweet, Why you eat grab with avocado? We've been trying to die shows before I stole my line. Can't do that when there's no pal, Jimbo. Oh, 
Uh-oh. That was glorious. Great. Nothing is skiing not great. Here it is, gentlemen. The moment you've been waiting for. Oh, this is so goofy. What the heck? He's going down reverse. Eww. You're gonna fall, dude. That was an ear approach. Okay. Try and take a turn. Rob, what the hell, what's your approach to the tire? I'm gonna do it gracefully, and with beauty. This is why I brought the, uh, the gardening gloves. Ready for this one? Immediate fall. It's different than snow there, Rob. Pardon? You going for another one? I'm gonna try and line up another big turn. Didn't work so well. You're really selling me on this jump turning method, Rob. <laughs> this is so much harder than it needs to be. One more turn. Woo. Uh, it's a little cream cheesy. What a blast. That rocks. Could call the day now. Can't get much better than that, man. Such a delight to have bluebird views, soft snow, and Polar Peak was absolutely wicked. We're just walking out of the truck right now. We're gonna take some layers off because we're hot, make a little cream cheese bagel lunch be uh, behind the truck, and uh, and maybe go into spring mode, potentially. Rising Alpine, this is Adventure Rob from the Sea Sky Herald. What are your thoughts on uh, spring skiing? It's a really good cream cheese bagel. That's not exactly what I asked, but I'm really glad I know that now. Uh, I'll give you a second to chew, work your way through it, really, you know, develop those thoughts. Mm. Those really, really detailed thoughts. Okay. Um, spring skiing, better or worse than winter skiing? Well, you know, Rob, there's no such thing as um, as bad skiing. All skiing is good skiing, and spring skiing is is one of the best kinds of skiing. Predictable snow, good times, um, hairy shirtless men. What more could you want with the spring day? I couldn't agree more, as an Alpine. Uh, which resort that you skied at do you think has the best patio beer? Well, so far the best patio beer was actually on the summit of Panorama. Um, without a doubt, I'm sure the boys would agree with me, but uh, we're about to check out a patio for another beer here, and uh, it's possible that Fernie could be a tight contender. Thanks for your time, James. I uh, enjoy the rest of your ski day. Thanks, Rob. Thanks for having me, as usual. My pleasure. <laughs> As you should with any spring day, we're gonna go find a patio to have a beverage on before we ski in our t-shirts. Ah, oh God. <laughs> Kokanee Gold Jug, 24 bucks, sold. We're in. This is a really nice patio. Oh, can he recover? Faces. Can he recover? I don't think he can. Okay, worst, worst pour I've made. Let me get redemption on this one. I slipped. That's a good pour. That's nice. That's nice. I'm gonna show uh, you a little hack for all the uh, the 19, 19 plus out there. Love it. I'm 35 with the top down. Quit to tell a hater they should get like me. Amazing. <laughs> Boss James, I want to give it a go. <laughs>
Don't give it a go. How did it taste? <laughs> Keep them separate. Sauce is for skiing. Beers are for drinking. Without sauce. Absolutely loved it. Unbelievable. Cheers, man. Everybody wanna be the boss, but it costs and these lames ain't shit like me. Drop a couple bands on the crypto fans, no way shit go. I ain't gotta tell them what it is. Tell them I'm a grown ass. Adventure Rob, it's, uh, it's, it, it's James, your counterpart from the Sea to Sky Herald. Um, you were asking me before um, where we had the best patio beer. Uh, where does this where does this beer here at the Grizz Bar in Fernie stand up against uh, all the other patio beers we've had on this, uh, this ski trip? Right, well, it's hard to say. It's a team game. Uh, there's no such thing as bad beer. Uh, I, you know, I've had a lot of memorable beers in my life. It really depends on who I'm playing with, where the beer is, and, and how cold it is. Uh, I would say this is a uh, this is a top-notch beer. This is a memorable beer, and I will think about this beer off. Well, I'm glad it's uh, I'm glad it's a beer that's going to stick with you for a long time, there, Rob. Uh, I'm going to pass the uh, the mic over to James here. James, um, obviously you're looking incredible. Um, it lo lo looks like this don't come for free. Uh, what do you think about this patio beer? I think this patio beer, I mean, you can't go wrong with the coconut bowl. That is just crisp and delicious and cold. I mean, with a view like this, you one of the best beers I've ever had. He talked. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap. Is that Adventure Rob? James here from the Sea to Sky Herald again. Um, You've been likened to, uh, to, to Pamela Anderson. Um, what are your thoughts on, on that statement? Truthfully, uh, a little disrespectful. I've been likened to Margot Robbie before, and I, uh, you know, just connect with that statement a bit more. Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> Catch Rob. Holy cow. Why did I do that? <laughs> why, why did I do that? <laughs> All right, well. You start the trend, Rob? Yeah. All right. All right. Grip it and rip it. Later, Rob. Later, skaters. Yeah. Well, if you guys are doing a Hawaiian shirt, they got a Hawaiian shirt on. Hey! Oh! Yeah. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> James, right. are you sure you want to do this? You've never skied a black diamond in your life! Quivering in my <laughs> boots! Okay, well, don't fall off the other side. <laughs> Please. Good luck, my friend. You too. Oh! Woo! <laughs> Biggest rock at the top. Really? <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This guy has the most radical jump turns. Yeah, dude, he's a great jump turn. Yeah!
the doggles. Nice. That's a tree. A little bit of slush, eh, boys? That was a so slush. sticky. That was like grabbing. A little bit of slushy slough. acapella band earlier this trip but we, we, we still haven't landed on a name. I think we got rebranded the three wins. The what? The three woodwinds. Oh three, three woodwinds. Wood uh, wood three wins. That's good. Three okay. wins. That's good. Yeah. I don't wanna wanna feel like I did that day. Take me to the place I love. Take me all the way. I never wanna feel like I did that day. Take me to the place I love and take me all the way. Hey, 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 she a rebel, she a bad little bitch, she a devil. Ooh, she a rebel, she a bad little bitch, she a devil. Ooh, she a rebel, she a bad little bitch, she a devil. <laughs> <laughs> Is that even a real song? This whole ridge is just properly terrifying to the left. Well, couldn't see those. <laughs> Jiminy Cricket. Holy smokes. Here's the longest bump run a man can find on this mountain. Oh. Party lap. Party lap. Yeah. <laughs> Why is it so good? Holy cow! Oh, that is an exceptional run. Oh. Fernie is way too much fun. That was great. They gotta stop that. It should be illegal. Yeah. How long does it take two men to fold up a pizza box? 